skip the light and dangle Turn cartwheels across the floor I was feeling kind of seasick But the cry called out for more home and harder as the ceiling fell away when we call up for another train the way to board a train and so it As a miller told his tale, had a face at first just ghostly, turned a wider shade of face. Said there is no reason, and the truth is plain to see. I wandered through my playing cards, I would not let it be. One of sixteen vessel virgins who were leaving for the coast. And although my eyes were open, they might as well be closed. And so it. As a miller told his tale That a face at first was ghostly Turned a wider shade of face Hey, what's up, YouTubers? Lee John Blackmore here at Super Easy Guitar. So this week, Procol Harum's A Whiter Shade of Pale. This is a song that I fell in love with from a very early age, and I, I didn't really understand it. I didn't understand the lyrics, but I, I love the melancholy about it. I just, you know, I love that feel. Some people loathe it, you know, but um, it's just a song that stayed with me a long time. I've never actually played it live. Maybe I will. Um, with a bit of practice, okay? Uh, I'm not sure the guitar does the song justice, but still a beautiful song. Let's zoom in and take a closer look. All right, so these are fairly straightforward chords, actually. So as a rule with the strumming, I tend to pluck the root note and then follow it with a strum. So that's a good way of starting, okay? So it's just gonna be C major. Then this is just dropping down the second finger to B, so it's B over C. Nice and easy to A minor. Now, some of you might find that tricky. Bring the pinky up to the third fret on the bottom E. G over A minor. You could try it like that with the thumb. And then we're down to a F major. Then just open the E and the chord stays the same, okay? So you can either do it with the bar 
or the thumb like I was just showing you. Okay, then D minor. Now when you do this D minor, it always reminds me of the D minor from like Imagine. So instead of using fingers one, two, and three, use one, two, and pinky. And then look, you can put that third finger, third fret on the A string to play C over D minor, okay? So hopefully you're with me so far. Let's go back to the beginning. C, drop, A minor, G over A minor, F, open E over F, D minor with the pinky, add that third finger. Okay, then we're over to G. So I like to use my thumb there. I'm playing a G. Now, you can do that F, or you can just go. You could play just that F note. There's no big deal, okay, if you can't reach it. I know it's a bit of a stretch. Then we go to E minor. And a D minor. Now it's not strictly a D minor. You can play all the notes, so you can play like E over D minor, okay? But that works nice on the acoustic. And then it goes to C, F, G, F, G. So that's the intro down. Now you see me doing different F, but it doesn't matter how you do it, okay? Whatever's comfortable for you. So as for the chorus, it actually comes in on a, a G or a G7, but I find it's easier to come out of the verse. F, E over F, D minor. And so it was. So it's kind of just a tension chord, G7. And so it's C drop, A minor, and you know the rest. The only thing I see people doing a little bit different is when it comes to the um, wider shade of pale, and they throw in this, like this G6 chord, which, you know, works nicely. You can put it in there if you want. Leave it out if you don't, no big deal. Straight back in. So there you have it guys, hope you enjoyed this week's lesson. Please don't forget, hit that subscribe button if you like to receive my weekly updates, okay? Don't forget the bell button, you know, so you get notified. Remember, please, I don't get paid for these cover lessons, guys, due to copyright, but I have set up a PayPal donation button over on my website. Any loose change is massively appreciated. Everyone that uh, donates on a regular basis, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Don't forget, I've got some t-shirts for sale. Check out the link on my website and you know you can sign up over there and I do a month monthly newsletter as well. Enjoy, guys. I'll see you again the same time next week.